Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm reacting to the seventh and last episode of Baby Reindeer. I'm a little bit sad because I really enjoyed this show. But it's okay, it's okay. And all the shows end and it has been such a nice journey. The previous episode was a very emotional one. We saw Donnie reflecting on his mistakes, on what has happened to him, on everything. First, we, we saw him hit rock bottom with uh, Terry uh, leaving him, with uh, Martha winning uh, in the battle of the police because she has been... Um, Apparently, she has been uh, recording all their um, conversation and stuff, and she has given that to the police. So now, although I think that that police woman did understand that Martha was still a stalker, uh, she couldn't do anything with this stuff in her hands because it looked like uh, Tony was. Um, he was not enabling all that, but he was supporting that. He was he wasn't that of a victim by by the evidence. Anyway, I don't know, but yeah, there uh, there wasn't anything left for Donny, so he was totally down. And he had a nice scene where he answered back finally to Martha, and that didn't go well. And then. He had that monologue that was phenomenal. The acting, the writing, as I said again, it was it was amazing. It was very emotional. So again, as I said it again, I'm expecting perhaps some some happiness, some calmness, some closure, some good stuff for Don in this episode. I hope. Yeah, that's what uh, that's how I want this series to end. Let's see. So yeah. We are finishing. Um, we are finishing, baby reindeer. I want to thank you so much for um, being in this ride with me. I'm sure I will thank you also at the end, but I wanted to do that now too. Anyway, if you enjoy my reaction, please like this video. Please, please subscribe to my channel and please stay tuned for any of my reaction to any new shows. I would uh, really like to have you around. Anyway. Let's watch the final episode. It starts with a happy song though, so it gives me... It gives me hope. It went viral? A random audience member recorded me on the sly and uploaded the video to YouTube and it went viral. I wouldn't actually upload that if I if it was me, but anyway. It was so overwhelming that I almost didn't notice that Martha had stopped emailing. Too distracted by all the new work opportunities to take notice. I just started coming out with them. Podcasts, radio shows, bigger gigs, better crowds. I'm happy I'm for him. I'm happy for the person that posted it. I really felt like I was going somewhere. Ladies and gentlemen. But still, I would it. I would feel that it's something very personal to post it on the internet. But and there is nothing obviously, it helped him. So visibly well to let your sexual abuser know, fuck you. You failed to break me. Mm. Ah, thank you very much. Yeah. Now, yeah, that's nice. Seen the Although there is a guy in the front row here looking at me a bit funny. Is it possible to get a DBS check on this guy, please? <laughs> what? What is a DBS? <laughs> Everything. It was like my life began three decades in. Mm. And all I needed to do to achieve it was to be honest with myself. Yeah, it's, it's never it's late to start your life again. And sometimes I would find myself in the free fall of happiness. I wonder what it was in me that kept it in for so long. Oh. What it was in me that felt so afraid. I'm happy for you, Donny. Hello? I wasn't going to speak to you ever again, but I've just been putting down the basics regarding what you said on stage. See, the appearance, no? About all that in the video, yeah? The shirt lifting and the guy's half hanging out again. I mean, should I tell them? Probably fair to know their son's an ugly little bum boy. What? At least you deserve for all those things you said about me. I cannot express how furious I am about the way you... That's what you got from that video, Martha? possible time during the most important moment of my professional life, Martha got my number. Right, yeah. Sick. Could I let her get my number? Yeah, right. He, she called him for the first time. Thought. How do you... I don't even spell like that in English. That I'm not an English speaking person. Fuck. I think they're going to want to know information like this, yeah? 
I don't think your dad looks like the accepted type. By the way, how did was bluffing, or if she would act I'm surprised the uh, his parents didn't learn about that. If a video a video goes viral, I guess people in your neighborhood also see it, young people and they tell other people and it reaches your parents' ears. I can't imagine something going this viral sorry, this viral and not reaching your parents, but apparently I'm mistaken. Yeah. Although I'm reading now the line, if she would do something as awful as tell my family, it will hurt them a lot to find out that the child was abused and raped. I don't know how the father would handle it, but I want to believe that he will see the, the true sad side and not the one that Martha is describing. Jesus, Martha. I just had to get to my parents before she did. Mm, yeah, that was the right move. Exactly. And the hardest move. Not that I'm not on social media, you know. Your dad. Isn't that fucking moron? Who? Okay. Thanks for that. He called him a moron? Well, I still feel very confused. And, um, I... I don't really know anything anymore. But I'm trying to, you know, like... He said I always get my get tears in my eyes. He's so I don't think I'm, I'm straight anymore. Um, okay. I think I'm probably like bisexual. Maybe it's a journey. Anyway, but it's it's, it's okay. I, I need to go with your support. That's not the hardest thing you said in that this video. Past few years have been really difficult, and I think you're gonna have a choice now. I will have to pause all the time, but uh, okay, my child being gay or bisexual or whatever, it would be fine. But finding out that he has been raped, it would break my heart. Anyway, I think that's the hardest thing from that video that they should know before someone else tells them. I think that's what I would want to know in order to support my child. Between a, between a bye son or a, or a gay son, whatever I become, or a dead one, because no. I can't handle it anymore. A dead one? Stop <laughs> it! Oh, love, that's easy. If you're given us a choice like that, then there's no question which one we're going to go for. Of course. Just let me finish. Of course, okay. Let him finish. I was, um... Raped. I was raped. By a man. Oh my God. I'm fine. All right, I promise. <laughs> How could you be fine after that? Online video, and now everyone knows. Yes. I just feel so fucking embarrassed. Don't I feel embarrassed. He should be in. I feel embarrassed. Because I did do less of me. Less of you. Less of that man. As a man. Oh, don't go, sweetheart. Say something, the father. I just feel. Thank you. Thank you. Eh? What? What did he say? Did that happen to the father too? I grew up in the Catholic Church. <gasps> oh! Yes, I, 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 oh! I don't understand. Oh, it's easy to understand. Sorry, to all the Catholics, but. Oh God. At least I'm happy they happy that they can't understand I each other. Say. They don't have to oh. say anything. Exactly. What would you Just want them to tell you? <laughs> that must uh, must have been so hard for him to speak to his parents. Yeah, hi Kim for the first time perhaps. <laughs> I'm so happy for you, Tony. <laughs> God, I have been crying in the last four episodes. I think I'm so sorry. I woke up to a new dawn. I felt lighter somehow. Amazing. Yes. Suddenly, I really felt like there was nothing in my way. Nothing. There is still Martha, but yes. <laughs> he 
he's overwhelmed by all the love now. <laughs> He went from light to darkness again, but for a small while, okay? Not for long. You have to deal with that. Martha! Obviously, with unknown numbers, it's very difficult to prove who it is it's actually calling. So what you're saying is I can call anyone I meet, as many times as I want, and as long as I withhold my number, I'm free to do as I please. Yes, that's what they are telling you. You're not planning to, are you? No, I'm not <laughs> to. I'm making a point. This behavior should be allowed. Reply to her. It's got her. Giving mm. away so easily after managing to keep it from her for so long. Mm. Why is that helpful? Yeah. Like, seriously. Uh, <clears throat> yeah. Now, I need to speak off the record here, but... Yes. It might make sense to keep your number and wait yes. for me to say something that we can use to expedite this case. You're serious? Nearly the same thing he tried to do before. Go on. But you... Mark down moments where she says something threatening. It's the same thing he did, but now he won't ask her to do so. She will, Martha will do it on her own. That's the difference. <laughs> Over the next few months, Martha's voicemails became the podcast of my life. Few months? Her on every bus ride, every tube journey. In the street between meetings, she was there in my That's terrifying. How do you keep being mentally sane after hearing all that all this time, anyway? Sometimes I couldn't believe the meaning she would glean from the most implausible of places. Mm -hmm. You surrendered to me that day, didn't you? By the water? Yeah, I, I started to download them, color code them into different emotions and subjects. All this fame means fuck off. They don't love you. They'll grow bored. I love you. It became an Shut up. up! I ignored work calls, cancelled gigs and interviews, devoted my No, life that's to winning too Martha, for Martha. Why she was the way that she was. I'm not sure I ever got close to finding the answer. You've got psychiatric mm. problems, darling. You, you have time, Martha. I found myself relating to her all over again. Our shared insecurities, our fears for the future. That's dangerous. The things that the way she managed to distract me from all the things that I'd lost. With another man, of course. Is anything new come up your side that we should know about? No. Oh. Holding off reporting her out of fascination, or empathy, or guilt. Any excuse, really, to keep her in my life. No, so, Donnie! So when I did eventually report her, I only oh. did it because she started on my family. I only did it because it felt like a risk I couldn't take any longer. But I could just about stab anyone in England, in Britain. So you better watch what you're saying, because maybe one day I will stab someone. Almost two years? This went on for almost two years? Guilty. Guilty? She will say guilty, won't she? Guilty? Mm. I want to say poor Martha, but no. Guilt. Stop crying. I don't want to feel sorry for you. Guilty. Guilty. <laughs> I don't want to feel sorry for my baby ring there. <laughs> yeah, that must hurt him. She will see him? Don't cry. I know it's hard, but don't don't feel sorry for her. She did that to herself, okay? Please take your own life back now. Nine months in prison, and a five-year restraining order was issued that same day. In that courtroom was the last time I ever set eyes on her. Good. That means that she didn't go after him after being released. Yeah, start writing some. Will we see him start writing this show? 
right here, perhaps. The story of baby reindeer and Martha. Baby reindeer, that's how he will start, right? No. Yeah, because you are a kind soul. That's why. Is it finished? No. Good. You don't look in a good state. Terry. Terry. Oh. Ah, oh, Kili. Especially Ben come out your room and wait. He has been writing, hopefully. I mean, she, she must have felt really bad after find out what okay. happened to him oh, while they were together. Because when you see them all splayed out like this, you really do yes. get a sense of just how mad she was. Mm. She was mad. Mm. Yeah. And it looks like you are mad too. You look awful. You're awesome. Mm. Why are you here? Because apparently she cares about you. I want you Which to see that nice. mom's place. Sort yourself out a bit. I mm. can't. I'm saying at least you. Yeah. No, I'll pay for it. Mm. Having gone through all of that. Yeah. That video, Donnie, it really upset me. Understandable. It would upset me too to find out that I was going through, <laughs> that my boyfriend was going through all that the time we were together. Yeah. Okay, I'm so sorry. So sorry. I've been crying the last four episodes. Sorry. At least it's the last one. <laughs> Will he find the photo of uh, Martha? No. Written by Tony Dunn. This is what he wrote for the abuser, the the boxer one. <gasps> oh, those this uh, this is his writing, isn't it? Right? Mm. Oh yeah, that must. <gasps> ah. Ah. Hi. You are in your house and not in prison. Can I open anything? Hmm. Just go directly to prison. I was wondering if I could come in. No. Don't go inside that house again. That will be painful, sure. You are so strong, Donny, for doing that. I don't know how are you able to do that. Like a cup of tea? Hmm. Or some drugs, maybe? Don't drink anything from his hands. You don't know what he will put inside the tea. So what? Have you just hired all the time? Oh my god, I've never seen two people consuming drugs like them. Mm. Private school boys too, I mean. Really? You didn't yeah. come here to love with him. But why did you come here? I'm sorry. He hasn't seen the video? No, I get it. You're sorry you disappeared? No, Donnie, it's not what you came here for. It's a video, by the way. Ah! Mm. Oh, I thought it was brave. Really brave. Seriously, no? Oh, thank you. I you don't understand. No! Oh, it won't be like last time. You'll be paid. Mm. No. Say what you want to say. The true words you want to say, not the... I love that. Really? I don't understand. Tony, that is your abuser. Why? Why? I... <sighs> Were you recording something in order to... But he didn't say anything. No. I don't understand. You were recording? God. And there was this other time in the bar when you were serving in your tight whites. I thought red, red is your color. She's like uh, his, uh, his safe place, you know, listening like to her. You know, very attractive. Yeah. 
he's uh, boosting his confidence. I didn't see, I will check again. <laughs> Was a folder called uh, something like that, like confidence, the confidence booster? Vodka coke? No, a diet coke. And I suppose that brings me to the baby reindeer thing. As I think you're probably wondering. And this baby reindeer beside me. Anyway, this reindeer was this cuddly, fluffy thing. Is the first time he's so listening to this? It was the only good thing about my childhood. Hmm. I thought she was abused I by her father. Him. I when thought of that. Mm. And they fought a lot, you know. It means so much to me. You. You mean so much to me. I want to feel sorry for Martha, really. But sometimes it doesn't make it easy to me. He's, feel, he, he's feeling guilty right now, isn't he? You sooner feel guilty. Apart from all that, she did some terrible stuff. She threatened you, your family. She she did that to Terry. You okay? Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, I'm fine. Sorry. Mm. He's going to do the same he did for Martha. Sorry, man. Yeah, he's go on the house. Don't worry about it. It's on me. Don't become a stalker, please. After that, <laughs> it will just be a sign that there is kindness in this world. I don't want to know how to feel about this ending, to be honest. Let me just... Why am I crying again? Anyway. I don't understand, okay? <laughs> what was this ending? I hoped for happiness. We got that at the beginning, so I did think that if we get that from the first two minutes of the episode, it's not going to go well. Then we got a really, really, really nice scene with um, his parents and his father, and I really enjoyed that. Then we got something that it was understandable, his confusion with Martha. We have seen him throughout the whole season, and. Uh, so that he has been strangling uh, to to hate Martha at times because at times again he would um, he would uh, how is uh, what is the word not sympathize perhaps the right word is sympathize or anyway to feel like Martha to to see traits on her that are his traits too. Is the world sympathize anyway? And uh, relate. Okay, that is the word. He related with Martha at uh, many points. So he left again his career and his life back in order to have this connection with her through the voicemails. And when he realized it, that it was enough, she is threatening to stop him and his family, it was time finally. To, to report her. And she was sentenced and yes, at that scene at the court, I felt bad for her, so it's normal for uh, Donnie to feel bad for her too. Okay. But I don't, I don't understand the part where he goes back to the abuser. I don't understand. I, I, that. I did see um, a, a YouTube video and the title was that... Um, uh, not he, not Richard Gatt, I think he's a, his publisher. Someone said that everyone in the industry knows who the abuser is. Okay, of course. Usually always uh, know. People know who that people are, but I don't know. But did that really happen? It, it, no. The scene probably did, the, the thing of him going back probably did really happen in real life, but did he actually really then work with him? I don't know, I, I, 
again some of the some of you have uh, recommended and thank you so much some videos that explain psychologically what is going through Donnie's uh, mind and I think I should definitely check them out now uh, I said that I would always check them out after the episode but at some point I, I decided that I want to finish the series so uh, it's my genuine reactions but now I definitely need to see them. I need to understand why did he do that? Why did he go back? I thought he he went back to express all his anger, which again it wouldn't be helpful. But okay, I all I wish from for Donnie for Richard. I have his name here. Do not forget it. For Richard Gad, if I'm pronouncing that right, is happiness. He's he's such an amazing person. So strong. So so kind so everything so whatever he chooses even if that uh, at that time was to go back and work with that man i hope he found happiness that's what i wish for him okay that's a, that, that that's what i want apparently he didn't um, end up with terry but i hope he he has found another partner that makes him happy and they are happy together also the last thing i hope it means that he realizes that there are people out there as kind as him and not that he becomes his token. No, that can't be. My dream might be right if you remember my dream anyway. I'm just saying stupid stuff because I don't know what to say. It, it confused me this last episode. But yeah, my wish remains. I hope he found happiness, whatever he chooses. It seemed like that I like that killy, that the killy stuff. Yeah, because as I said, I think I said it in the fourth episode, she wasn't that blame. The way she treated him, it was normal for a girlfriend that sees her boyfriend being like that. She didn't know the rest and it was, it was understandable and she's kind too. She, she felt sorry, she felt... All these feelings after that uh, video gone viral and understanding what he was going through and it was nice to welcome him back to the house where I think Liz will provide him the um, emotional safety that he needs. But again, for the tenth time, why did he go to the abuser? And it was this he is disgusting. This whole um, attitude that oh it was pray for you to talk about that and if you come back to work with me it won't be like last time like thank you very much and you will be paid for your work like fuck you you should be in prison and when i got a i said in the previous video that i got a comment that uh, that person that commented it, it pisses him or her um of that he, the abuser got away just I just thought that we wouldn't see of him again and he just got away not anyway I don't know I don't know I uh, again I hope that uh, Richard uh, found happiness in his life whatever the way he did it and it was very brave for him to write this uh, show and give it to us and we are very grateful I'm very grateful that I got to see that and I'm very grateful to you too for uh, following the journey and watching my videos. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I hope you liked my reactions. I really enjoyed having, having you along, so thank you so much again. I hope you subscribe to my channel. I hope you follow along to any of the rest of my reactions and comment down below what did you get from that move and from the last episode? I want to know what you think. That is all. Thank you so much. Bye.